showed that the sum of all vectors originating from the center of a regular octagon and extending to its vertices equals the zero vector. Okay, let us begin. First, we will consider an octagon. Let's name this octagon. Uh, we have the octagon A, B, C, D, E, F, G, and H. And we are also going to consider the center as O. Now we have to show that the sum of all the vectors originating from the center and extending to its vertices. Meaning, so from O, we are going to uh, draw a direct line segment to A. So this is going to be a vector OA. Similarly, we are going to draw another directed line segment from O to B. And like this, we were going to draw six more direct line segments from the center to the vertices of the given octagon. So here, our goal will be to show that the sum of OA vector to OB vector plus OC vector plus OD vector plus OE vector plus OA vector, OF vector plus OG vector plus OH vector uh, the, uh, sums up to zero vector. That's what we need to show. Now, because of the symmetry of the problem, here we have, if we consider the vector OA, this vector is going to be equals to uh, negative of the vector OE. So, OA vector will be exactly equals to the magnitude of OE vector, but they're in opposite direction, so that we have the negative sign here. Let's call it number one. Similarly, we have OB vector. The so OB vector will be equals to negative of OF vector. That will be number two. Then we have OC vector. OC vector will be equals to negative of OG vector. That is be number three. Then we have uh, OD vector. OD vector will be equals to negative of OH vector. That's number four. Now what we'll do, we'll sum up all the vectors. So we have OA vector added to OB vector plus OC vector plus OD vector. And on the right hand side, if we take negative as the common vector, we have OE vector plus OF vector plus OG vector plus OH vector. That's it. And then finally, we can say thus OA vector plus OB vector plus OC vector plus OD vector. We're going to transpose all the four vectors from the right hand side to the left hand side to get OE vector plus OF vector plus OG vector plus OH vector. And this will be equals to zero vector because we are adding up all vectors. So summing up the vectors must give us a vector on the right hand side. And since nothing is present, so this is simply going to be the zero vector. Hence proved.